Welcome to lesson number 44, Major Pentatonic Workout. To view the sheet music to this lesson, please visit my website at tjjazzpiano.com or simply click the link in the description below. In this week's lesson, we'll be looking at a technical exercise that I've written out using the major pentatonic scale. Remember to go slow at first and gradually increase speed towards mastery. First, we'll need to identify the notes of the major pentatonic scale for those of you who are unfamiliar with the scale. The major pentatonic scale contains the notes 1, 2, 3, 5, and 6 from its relative major scale. So in the key of C, we would leave out our F and our B, or the 4th and 7th notes of the scale, and we'd get this. You may want to practice identifying the major pentatonic scales in all 12 keys before continuing with this lesson. So now let's take a look at the pattern we're going to be taking through the entire major pentatonic scale. We'll be using the C major pentatonic scale as our guide. We'll start on the root, skip over the next note, the D, all the way up to E, step down to the next closest note, D, skip over the E to the next note, G. So we're starting on the root again, we're going to skip, step, skip. Then we're going to take that pattern through each individual note of the major pentatonic scale. So our next note is D. Skip over the E up to G, step down to the next closest note, E, skip. We'll combine them together. Then our next note would be E, skip, step, skip. And if we connect all those together, we get this. Now on the way down, we're simply going to do the pattern in reverse. So starting out with our top note of the pattern, G, or the fifth note of the major pentatonic scale, we'll skip down, step up, skip down. Our next note, E, skip, step, skip, skip, step, skip. When we chain all those together, we get Now we're going to play through the exercise. I've only written it out in two octaves, but feel free to play it through the entire range of the piano. I'll also be doubling the right hand melody with my left hand. Here's what it sounds like a little faster. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. I do come out with new videos every single week, so if that's something you might be interested in, please feel free to subscribe. Also feel free to contact me with any questions you might have about any of my lessons.